Uh, this is the Higher Education Status Matrix. Uh, basically, I designed this to show the movement of students through the recruitment cycle uh, for any given university. Um, the purpose of the presentation mainly is to show uh, many iterations to fit the custom order um, account manager's needs, whilst also giving a good overview of uh, colours and shapes. So the original version is the static version. And what I mean by static is a monthly or weekly report that might be PDF'd by the customer, but won't have any filters on because Obviously, if you use Tableau, you know you can't have any filters in a PDF, um, which is the obvious part. So <clears throat> I've highlighted in red, uh, negative to positive, apart from the exception, which is deferred. But because it's a made offer uh, stages of a university's uh, recruitment cycle, uh, deferred fits at the end. Uh, so there's just some uh, statuses that might be tailored differently for each university. You have withdrawn, declined, uh, conditional insurance, conditional, unconditional, and then at the end for this particular university accepted. The squares are the totals, uh, which has to symbolize movement. So the best way that I think about explaining this is like a set of traffic lights. Amber, you're ready to go. Green is go. Red, you've got to stop. And it's actually, in this case, it's a backwards motion. So to look at an example, you can see conditional insurance had 294 last week. One's moved to unconditional, and the next one is conditional accepted, which is a six of moved to there. Now, here is the calculations bit. The left is the ranking, uh, withdrawn being the worst, and offer accepted unconditional being 10. This then enables the right hand side calculation to work. Um, I must say, the shading with the numbers, you could have. Uh, you could have words instead of numbers, but the next slide will show what these mean. But current numbers equals last numbers three, current numbers greater than last numbers one, current numbers less than last numbers five. So this here where they, you can see behind me, um, you can see that one is green, three is uh, amber, five is backwards. And then to the right shows you where they sit on the pills. The next slide is uh, an interesting um, thing that happened to me whilst I was at work, and this was a uh, said uh, a customer said that they couldn't understand the report because they were colourblind, and even though it's quite common, I'd never actually come across this before. I instantly thought of using shapes, so as we did with the colour, drop the shading onto the shapes. The green arrows showed the movement forward, and the backwards movement showed by the backwards arrows, and again these circles represent the amber, where people have stayed stationary for this moment in time. And then finally, there was a further iteration, um, which had to be, uh, how do I get this video to work? So I'm gonna get this video to work, so much I apologize. Yeah, yeah it's working. So <laughs> the many different time views, uh, which is the first filter, weekly or monthly, which is achieved by a uh, sheet swapping technique, which you'll be able to get online uh, or be able to tell you um, afterwards. And then for this university, they want nationality to know where the country of residence uh, for the students, the uh, school, which faculty they were going to or which course. And again, we added further uh, information at the bottom, which is the total uh, of each stage in that week. So I'll leave this to play out. <laughs> yeah. 